And I say that was crazy. Roy Perdomo says he was driving on the 101 when this happened. The box truck he was driving clipped by the truck being chased by police. I was really loud, and, and that's why I say what happened here and why he is still driving. I mean, uh, he broke my uh, right mirror and then uh, thought he was like a hit and run. So I tried to catch to catch him. That Lowe's box truck was reported stolen roughly an hour before the crash. Well, I didn't know it was a pursuit or, you know, a chase uh, because I don't see any highway patrol behind me or behind him. At one point, Perdomo tries to get the driver's attention by driving alongside him, hoping he would stop. When I was driving by his side, I saw him and, uh, and I said, no, he, he's not he, he's not worth for Lowe's because he looks different. Adding that's when he knew it wasn't just an attempted hit and run. He was making like a, a signs, like a gang member or something. So, and I say, uh, this is something else. Eventually, the driver of the stolen Lowe's box truck gets off the freeway only to get back on. I tried to, you know, stop him and I pushed my brake and he hit me on the back. And I say, well, maybe he's going to stop. And I mean, nah, he continued. Perdomo continued trying to prevent the other driver from taking off. That's when he was hit a third time. No. He doesn't stop. So Perdomo says he pulled over and CHP officers talked to him. One of them, they say, like, uh, uh, thanks yeah, for trying. And Perdomo's truck was eventually towed to the Mr. Tire Warehouse here in San Bernardino, where you can clearly see it's out of commission with some body damage. There's a missing mirror, and in the front, you can clearly see there's no grill. Pick up the tire and win the delivery off to them. Jose Rodriguez, the owner of Mr. Tire Inc., says he's just happy Perdomo is okay. He's a great guy. He's always on time. He is a very, you know, work uh, mate, the best one. And yeah, I thank him for, for whatever he did yesterday. Adding this chase has increased attention on their business in a positive way. We have been getting more calls and I hope in the future, we'll get more business. The suspect eventually crashed in Ventura and made a run for it before CHP took him into custody. In San Bernardino, Lustelia Caballero, KCAL News.